Yeah, I'll react to that, sure. Hey guys. I like this because it's it's got like the stars, but depiction of the globe in a what is it, Mercantor, Mercantator style flat map. So it looks a bit different. But that's the point of the globe in it. I'm sorry. Yeah. Let's do it. Nigel Owens, great name. I don't know what it is with the hat. I just I um I just feel like I put on a different persona when I have the hat on, and I just, I'm ready to go. No, I just, I like it. I'm projecting. Nobody asked. Staying on. Let's do it. Uh, Nigel Owens being Nigel Owens. Ten more minutes. This is rugby, so um, I believe rugby... Uh, rest. Still time to influence this half and that scoreboard. He didn't even strike for the ball. I can't put it under his foot because otherwise they're going to win the ball. Well, that's the whole point of the contest that it's in the middle, that it's a fair contest. <laughs> strike for the ball. Okay, so I'm to say, so... Hey, if you're going to cheat, you cheat fair. I can keep the standards now. He's done it again. We both strike for the ball. Nigel Owens coming up with gold. Decent now, please, CJ. Off you go then, please. Um, we have a clear tackle with the ball, okay? It's a professional tackle with the ball because the ball is nowhere near and he's just taking the man clearly out in this position and that's going to be a yellow card yeah. against the second row. Yeah. I haven't got my cards. Just the yellow? <laughs> he yeah. hasn't got his cards. I haven't. I, I, I said I, I there was going to be something. Card, right. It would be interesting. <laughs> Nigel Owens has forgotten oh. his cards. On comes Adam Jones. We wanted some entertainment. <laughs> he's found I just got to pause it quick. Card. It'll return. from a broken... <laughs> All right, sorry. Just I wanted to give a shout out. Um, Holbeck Max, thank you for the video. Right back into it. Sorry about that, gents. Let's do it. Come on. Okay. Foot. Entertainment. He's found a replacement card. Recovering from a broken I'm foot. Here, don't worry, yeah. But there's nothing I can do about injuries, okay? Unless I think, unless I think, yes, but I'm not a doctor. I'm a lot of things, but I'm not a doctor. Huh? Don't swear now, you're on telly, man. <laughs> Dan Carter made a comment to Nigel Owens, which is... Uh, I'm tired. Yeah, something similar. <laughs> yeah, something similar. You're on telly, says the referee. I wanted to put it up to 720p. I like this guy already. Uh, 20 minutes gone. Uh, at the moment, I'm just I deal with everybody here because there's nothing I can pick out unless you tell me anything different. And from after, there's nobody, nothing that's clear and obvious there at all. Get everybody in here, please. Get everybody in here. Get them all in here. Get them all in here. Get them all in here. I, I won't buy so much. I'm sorry. But this is someone who I can tell, put him in any profession that demands authority and, uh, you know, a little bit of management. And this guy, I'm sure, will do amazing at it. Yeah. Get them all in here. Get them all in here. Get them all in here. I can't take Nigel, but... Is your kind of car to kind of let go on her for a while? No, you could. Shall I? That is totally unacceptable. Is that clear? If I have to deal with any issues like this again now, people are going to be not playing 80 minutes in this game or whatever time is left. Is that clear? Now get on and play rugby. I'm going to go back to the penalty for no arms tackle here and it's a penalty only. This is the last warning to you all. Did I look for Marga for Nigel Owens? There's a concern for Joe Smith. Does he need to go to have a test? No, we've got a word in that he didn't... Chris Henry. Are you okay? You sure? What's my name? Oh, what a great Nigel guy. Name, Oi! The football stadium is 500 yards away. I think Nigel Owens is warning Anthony Allen there about... He can always go to the football stadium just over the road if he he's going to answer back. He's in for on to it. Too long there. Get away, get away, get away. Dixon and Phillips. It, um, it was only really a question of time. 
There's no way, if there's no wall at all. Just be quiet and stay there, please, because I can have a word with you now. Stay there, please. Time out. Are you finished? <laughs> right, come here. Are you finished? He has such a demeanor about him that I don't know if it can be taught. It just, he commands authority while not being... Um, insulting in any way and very likable and yet respectable. He seems to be loved and feared. When I give the penalty and it's against you, you do nothing with that ball. You held on to it there. Don't you go in looking for things as well. Just go and receive the ball nothing more. I ain't going to take you on 10 meters for your actions. Get back, get on your own game. Yeah? And on 10. Right. Time, time out. Time out. Nina rates our sauce then. Two captains, come here, please. John, John, come here, please. Where are they? No, no, Chilly, no. huh? Don't, don't, look, don't look so worried. Look, oh. wait, wait, wait. all I'm getting at the moment are players shouting, knock on, offside, tackle out the ball. Um, we're in the wrong sport for that. Right. So go and have a word of them. Unless, because if I hear somebody shouting again, it's going to be a straight penalty, all right? He so, turns... Uh, no, there's a lot of them. He okay. turns these giant grown men into, you know, in mere seconds, into little, uh, you know, middle schoolers going to the principal's office. It's, with them. it's really funny. Hey. They've got Steve Cazzo in there, and Bordeaux back over the line, and uh, Nigel Owens again, as he did in the first half looks himself and says held up and back for the five meter scrum and no i was not proposing i asked do you want the whistle then we both smiled as he said no thank you really nice from bordeaux the minute they start they stop running at chest and shoulders and start running at arms start moving the big fellows of claremont around sergio i have a lot of respect for you but that respect needs to work the way. There's nothing wrong with happening there. It was a knock on. He's quite entitled to go off his feet and play the ball afterwards. If I hear you shouting or complaining again, you may not finish this game. Is that clear? <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> All of these guys are enormous. I just want to see, I just want to get on the field and have one go. Give me one go to run it up. See how far I can get. So his evening's over. It's a big boy. I'm quite loud, but there's 50,000 here a bit louder than me, boys. Just keep it going, please, okay? When you're ready, I'll put the time on, all right? You know, well, there's a few of you. That, that's not acceptable in this game. If somebody makes a mistake, we just get on with it. We don't clap and cheer, okay? I'm going to let it go this time. I don't want to see it happening again. Not in this game. Look, you got in. Just wondering, what is he wearing? Is he wearing like some kind of padding in case he got hit? It seems like there's some kind of st uh, thing on his chest and and uh, back. Unrelated, just something I noticed. Look, you got in with your leg, and it's a trip, and that's a yellow card offense. Okay, James, thank you. Damn it. You will give the one who caused it. Even. That is the end of the matter. I don't want to speak to you again. Is that clear? Yeah. Is that clear? Thank you. Go and speak to your team. I will start the penalty year against you here. Go and speak to them. plants those feet and okay. he's off and running again will you leave it and get on so it, powerful a run away do it off the field not on it do it off the field. yeah cowan sees a bit of a gap and off he goes referee in trouble big trouble better blow your whistle sir you see him here so he gets pushed by Johan smith and he's gone right down on Scott Burgers Burgers gone right on top of him. Got a hit. I love that you can see the face in rugby in such a con in such a contact sport. I know like six percent of my audience is American, maybe seven percent. I know vast majority of you are not American football fans. It's not even my favorite sport to watch, really. I, I prefer basketball. But you know, in football it's that like you 
they have all these pads on you can't really see who's who and or you know who's where but just something about like when someone gets a big hit or gives a big hit you just want to see the look on their face which you get in this game well, I just watch you on smith here he's actually giving them a fair old push you are a bit unlucky you go to make the tackle and he slips as you make it it's high and it's nothing more than just a penalty okay thank you that is great refereeing Harrison. Uh, at the at the tackle and he's committed so there's no issues with the tackle okay so nothing to do with you so you can go no, no, nothing wrong with the tackle he's already committed okay and then whatever causes it but you come in and you grab somebody around the neck okay? yes i know you want whether you want to stop it or not you cannot grab people around the neck okay and i'm just going to penalize you this time and nothing more whether you stop it next time please do not grab them around the neck to try to stop them okay and i'm going to go the penalty there against you is that fair enough Okay, That's a good you. call, Nige. That's a good call. Through Aaron Wainwright, and now it's been turned back over. <laughs> Sam Davis gives it to Nigel. Good take, Nigel. Good take. <laughs> and wait wait oh. for, the, for the multiple hits. That's a free hit, isn't it, surely? <laughs> if he's ever done well, anything to... Uh... Now, if you were a player, and even if you didn't notice it was him, and just decked him, like, <laughs> would you? I wouldn't. I love this guy. But like, would you would you have an excuse? <laughs> uh, to annoy you. That's a free hit, isn't it? Surely. <laughs> like they. Uh... He's ever done no, anything you... to uh, to annoy you? That was the time to you get him back. You were asked if possession to be your ball. Sorry, boys. The ball came straight to me. Given a piece, and England are kicking off before the referee's ready. Same ball, lads. I I told you this last year. Same ball. Are you forgotten of you? Right. Same ball. He's like a dad and all great his kids engine, man. He's got a deceptive turn of pace. That's not straight if you want it. Not straight if you want it. Not straight if you want it. Big call coming in from Nigel Owens on the touchline yes, okay. to the referee saying that's not straight if you want it. Si we will deal with them, not you. Now, I quite clearly, and the touch judge is quite clearly saw your arm throwing a punch. We believe that full contact was not made, and that is why you are very, very lucky and only having 10 minutes. Do you understand? Yes. When you come back to the field, if I have to speak to you again, it will not be a yellow card next time. You are very, very cautious. We believe full contact was not made. Final decision. Take a team out of the way, please. Captain, take a team out of the way. Well, Ben Roe August from the left year picture is just absolutely hitting the deck. But maybe overplay acting from a push by a Saracens player. Let's listen right. in. Away. I'm going to go upstairs for Sivall to check it is in the fry. Am I happy it's held up? Are you happy it's held up or do you want me to double check? We need to check. We need to check. Okay, I'm going to check first. What have you got for me after that? After that, there was a the bit of a scuffle, which was nothing. Then 11 black struck an opponent on the throat. Struck him. Yes. Okay, open palm. What did he do? Did he punch him or what happened? Just, uh, open just push him, yeah. So this is going to be just a penalty. Penalty. It's going to be reversed because I was going to go back with the advantage. So is he like the main ref, Nigel's the the, uh, the main ref, and then these are kind of the side refs or the, you know, right, he can't be everywhere at the same time. You need refs to be able to look at different angles. And he's giving him his opinion because he, he seems like such a great leader if he is in, it kind of, you know, ahead of the other refs in terms of making the call, just hearing what they have to say. Great guy. This guy seems like a really great guy. If it's no try, and cancelling that advantage out, I'm going to give a penalty here. Correct. Correct. Okay, hold on. He now knows I what to do. I was advantage for the offside. The ball was held up, no try. If it wasn't a try, I would have gone back with a penalty here. That penalty is cancelled out because your player pushed the guy in the throat after the whistle had gone. The penalty now is against you. Here. Back you go. So much respect for someone like that. Um, I can tell in any, in any profession, any job, that he is going to be. He's going to excel at it when it comes to managing anything. Cool video. Thanks for the uh, recommendation. Continuing my journey, my quest to learn more about rugby, cricket, soccer, football, most of you guys call it. Uh, so, yeah, I think I'm going to try to keep more of a schedule of history videos during the week and then stand-up and um, you know comedy and sports videos on the weekend. I'm not great at sticking to schedules, but hope you guys are doing well. If not, that sucks, but that sucks. You'll be good soon. Don't worry. See you next time.